and welcome back to Dobbo's Fishing Adventures. Where are we today then? Oh yeah, South Warm Beach. Just fancied it, off the cuff. Beautiful evening. Wind's offshore, so I'm getting some good distance already. First cast, so we've just got to see what happens. Apparently there's a club comp uh, down here tonight, so quite a few people down here. A little bit further down where, uh, from where I had that codling the other week. So, <clears throat> fingers crossed. I don't think it was a one-off because I know there has been a few caught here, so let's see what happens. So at the moment I've got two uh, two rigs, both baited with worm. As soon as it gets to dusk I'll uh, put the fish baits on. But yeah, what a, what a stunning evening, isn't it? Look at that. It's beautiful. Usual tactics, so I've got a three, three hook clip down with worm and a two hook clip down with worm. Once again, I've got me Ziplex M4 Hyflex M's coupled with the Abu 65 TSRs. Ideal for this beach, which I've said before, gives me good distance and as I say, I don't need nothing fast to bring it in. There's no snags out there, so to speak. So yeah, let's uh, let's bring it on. I shall keep you all informed as the evening progresses. To be fair, I can't wait to get the fish baits on. Another couple of hours and uh, I certainly will be putting them on. So bring it on. Speak to you in a bit. Happy days, first cast. Just had a little place. Nice. Gets us off to a flying start. Happy days, right. I didn't have my GoPro on the edge at the time, so if I do a quick one here, nice little place, happy days. Bring it on. Well, let's have that place on first cast. Let's try this one. Remember the GoPro this time. Let's see what we've got. Doesn't feel like much. Few more people fishing down here now. Beautiful evening, isn't it? Happy days. Right, let's get it back out. Beautiful down here now. Absolutely stunning. 
red tips are just starting to rattle away, even after a couple of minutes of being in the in the water there. One place to take it so far, so happy days. No weed this time, so that's good. Just want a bit of tide one now. There it goes. And uh, that fish a few fish through. So fingers crossed, I'll get the bigger boats on later. Bring it on. <coughs> well, I have to say, getting quite a few bites now. Good bites as well, to be fair. <coughs> I'm feeling better. The weight there might be a little bit of weight. Beautiful evening, isn't it? Absolutely stunning. Come on, fish, where are you? I think there's something there on this one. go to another place. Happy days. There we go. Cool. Take it back. Nice. It'll be nice to get the bigger baits out in a minute. Right, let's get it baited up and get it back out. Two plays so far. This might be a little bit heavier, not sure. That's cracking. I keep saying it, but it's cracking even. Yeah, I might have something on it. A little bit of weight maybe. So we'll see. Got a few people fishing along here. I'll say there's that club pump going on. That's good. Right, 
Who was that, Bill? I'm going to show you something there. There we go. Double shot of place. what it's all about, the Southbourne Beach. Not huge. So that's four plates now, double shot there. Happy days, bring it on. Let's get her back out. Well, four plates so far. Can't wait to get the fish bait out. Probably another half hour, get it proper dark and get some uh, better baits out. So I'm certainly getting lots of rattles at the moment. There's plenty of fish out there at the moment, so that's good. Keeping me active, but four fish. And only one cast so far, there's nothing. So. We've certainly given them a long soak, probably at least half an hour plus. So on that is the uh, squid. Uh, I haven't put mackerel on this time, I've put black lug. So squid and black lug. So we'll see what happens and that's on the older uh, up and over. And we'll uh, see what happens. Yeah, it's something beautiful evening. Quite a few people down here fishing now. As I say, that club's coming to go. Two guys up there have had plenty of fish. Yeah, that's a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful evening. but there's been tons of fish caught so far. I say, the good thing about South Wall is you can do a close in the path, hit it as hard as you like. There seems to be plenty of fish at all ranges. That's what makes this uh, beach very appealing to people. You certainly don't have to do a big cast, but admittedly I do hit it hard. I'll get as far as I can, but that's true. Sort of habit. Still, if, you can't fast, if you can cast fast, should I say, then you can always drop it in place, that's how I look at it. But coming from the Isle of Wight, then generally, you know, a, a good cast is generally beneficial. Alright, let's bring it on. Come on, fish, where are you? Got my little baby there. Just right, keep a bit of dampness off. They were supposed to have been giving a lot of rain tonight, but that was only a two day forecast today, that was. And it's beautiful down here. Bring it on. <coughs> right, time for another bait check. Little rattles going on all the time. I think I might have hurt me uh, first proper bait out now. See what occurs. Double look what we got here. Mm, not sure. Oh, it's absolutely beautiful. No, I don't think there's anything in this one.
feels a bit better than last time where I had that horrible wind blowing into me. That onshore breeze last time. That was a pain trying to get any distance. So they're certainly going well out there today. Nothing that time. Place been well mullered. Right, let's get it back out there. <coughs> right. This one's gave a couple of good bites then. Let's see what's happening with this one. Yeah, now that. A little bit more weight on that one, so fingers crossed. Yeah, let's give me some good rattles. Yeah, there's quite a bit of weight there. Unless that grip's just, uh, nah, something there, I think. Yeah, it's quite a bit of weight. This is the one I'm going to put the bigger bait on anyway. Yeah, there is quite a bit of weight. What's on here then? There we go, little garnered. Beautiful, oh, let's get him back, get the bigger bait out now. Happy days. <coughs> well, just had a good cracking bite on that, slack liner, so a bit slack there. Let's see what happens. That was a good, good pull. Yeah, loads of slack line there, look. I don't know if he's there, if it is, it's probably a swimming fish. That was a cracking bite. Good old pull down, slack. A few little pulls afterwards. But unless it's swimming with me, it doesn't feel like anything there. There, there. It might be. Oh, it's hard to tell. I oh, know. I don't think there is. There might be. I <laughs> keep saying yes or no. Who knows? Oh yeah, there's something there. Yeah, bass, I bet. There it is on the top one there, isn't it? Bass. Oh, it's on the bottom there. There we go. Happy days. Cool. There we go, little bass. Slightly bigger, bring it on. Well, I cannot believe.
leave it. Second codling in two trips, South Bourne Beach. Unbelievable. Talk about whale chub. So I'm fishing bigger bait on one rod, and this one took the uh, free hook clip down with rag. Thought it was a bass, but no, I'm really pleased with that. <laughs> Can't get over it. Nice. Let's have a look at the other side. I just, uh, certainly a lot skinnier compared to the last one I had. Not a lot at all on that. <laughs> I know there's been quite a few caught along here. But uh, as I said, I had that one a couple of weeks ago, maybe three weeks ago, whenever it was, on the other video. So here we go. Number two, South Bourne Beach. On rag this time. Happy days. <laughs> right, let's see what the, see what the first fish bait rod's doing. Nothing, I don't think. Still, four plays, one gurner and a bat so far. Pleased with that. No, nothing on that one. I'm not hanging around winding it in. You know when they're coming on there. The tide will start turning in a minute. Get a little bit more current going. A bit more flow. That's what we want now. That's I'm now double patting now. Making life easier. So the next one is a bomber with squid, lug, and a bit of mackerel wrap. So hopefully that'll uh, appeal to something out there. Let's go for it. <laughs> Typical, isn't it? Baiting up, just turn around, massive slack line everywhere. Just tightened it up and uh, yeah, something pulling away on it. Yeah, something there. Felt that then. Oh, now that's got a bit of weight to it. I can actually feel the weight in that this time, so that's good. Let's uh, see what we got. Oh, well, there was a bit of weight there. Oh no, something, yeah, something there. Oh, there we go. It's not massive, but uh, definitely something on there. Oh yeah, go on there. <laughs> I felt you then, and again, go on. Oh, yeah. Just slow the winding up just a little bit. You don't know if they're just lightly hooked. Oh, there it goes. Come on then. Oh, yeah. Little nod then. What we got? Can't be far off now. Going, oh, there it goes, go on then, it's going down that side of the tide. What we got, there's the leader knot. Another bass. Yeah, a bit bigger. Oh no, it's a codling. <laughs> Another codling. Beautiful. 
Can you believe it? That's what I like to see. And there we go. We have another codling. Two in two trips. Get the light off it really, but I'll take some pictures and uh, happy days. Well pleased. Another codlin. Well, I have to say, since having that codlin, it has. Uh, I'm very, very quiet. Very similar to the last time. So the scores on the doors are four place, one bass, one gurnard, and one codling. Now I do believe uh, there has been some more codling up to the left of me caught, so it's a good sign. Don't think there's anything on there, might be something, maybe a bit of weed, I don't know. That tide is uh, running a little bit now. Yeah, very enjoyable evening so far. Not fast and furious, but there is fish there. Nah, I don't need anything. getting touched quite so much now weird but it is what it is right let's get it back out again oh, I was hoping the old fish bait might produce but Nothing as of yet. Oh, a little bit of weight there. Is there or not? Nah, oh, I'm not sure. Probably because I've got a fish bait on it, just feeling a little bit, a little bit of drag there. I don't know, it might be a little bit of weight there. No, I don't know. I don't know. Is there something there? Yeah, there is. What we got? <laughs> there we go. Strap hill. Oh, I can't get away from these bloody things. There we go. Little strap hill. <laughs> Happy days, Bournemouth Beach for you. Well, this is the last cast I've done now. Yeah, it's weird how it just went slow for some reason. I don't know why it went slow, but it did. And uh, so. weight on that one um, other than that eel it's been, uh, it's been very quiet after that codling I 
has a little bit of weight on it. Not 100% sure. But yeah, what can I even Still can't get over, I've had a second cod, but happy days. Come on, fish. Mm -hmm. I can't quite tell, I think there might be something there. That or a little bit of weed running through, but I haven't had nothing yet, weed wise. If we keep things uh, quite simple down here, I think that's the way forward. Don't overcomplicate anything. Yes, I've got something. There's something there. What have we got? We have a tiniest little ray going. <laughs> there we go. Oh, a bit tangled up. Probably because it was spinning. Let's, uh, let me show you guys. Put that one out of the way. How beautiful. Let's get that down a bit. How beautiful is that? That tiny little thorn back. Beautiful. Well, that's rounded it off. Little tea bag. Nice. Nice the oats. You'll certainly go back to see if he can get a lot bigger. There he goes. Cool. So it's a little thorn back to the species. So you what, I'll wind this one in straight away. I've already packed the, the bivvy up. No, nothing on the fish bait. I won't mess around. I'll get it in quick. I have to say these reels are these reels are superb for down here. Effortless casting. They certainly don't birdie up at all. Ah, oh, really nice. End of another session. End of another Bobo fishing adventures. Well, I hope you've enjoyed it. Certainly as much as I have. So what was, the, what was the scores on the door? So it ended up being four plates, one bass, one gurnard, one codling, one thornback, and a little scrap of Brilliant. Easy, easy fishing. Southbourne Beach, you've got to give it a go. Dead simple fishing. Nice sandy beaches. Oh, and that's a good thing as well. There's plenty of bins around, so please make sure you take your litter and just place it into the bins. Do not leave it down here. Let's keep this venue safe and let's keep it going.
and more of you guys to try so there you go well, i hope you've uh, hope you all liked it if you'd like to like and subscribe that would be fantastic uh, the next time it might be out in the boat again who knows but the wind uh wind is getting up this week it's getting a lot colder apparently from monday onwards for a few days so uh hopefully that'll push a pod in to bring it on that is dobbo's fishing adventures out number two coddling of the year happy days see you later